bantam weight division there's there's a, a number of big names in that division um so who would you most like to have faced at the moment at yeah the, moment. the current bantam weights yeah and present or past already, which is more at the moment. Uh, we'll, we'll get into past as well, but presently, who would you most like to have faced? Probably, obviously, I was going to rematch Lee McGregor. I would like that, but if mm. it wasn't him, I would love to fight Nito De Niro and Ewa. I would just, just to mm. say, no, I, I don't know. You know, I'm not going to say I'm going to beat them and say I was good enough. And I'm not saying that. I'm just saying it would have been good to go in with them and uh, say, you know what? I boxed a great fire. However, mm. the result ended, you know what I mean? But I would have just like to go in the fight and say, you know what? I would like to, I, it's great to be in another with a great fire, pound for pound best, because, uh, listen, everyone would love to say I, I was a box Muhammad Ali, even though they, they got knocked on the first minute of the first, first round, you know what I mean? They would have just love to say a box Muhammad Ali, you know, but it's like that with me as well. So if I was in with a new I would need to do or something, I would love to say, listen, I boxed him and, uh, you know, I was in with a great fire. Yeah. That's, that's, um, Interesting because then I would like to know how would you game plan for someone like Inyo, for example, or, or Dene? How would you, what would your game plan be going in? You know, it's, it's a hard one to say because, uh, you know, you are, you have to just, it's on the night. I really, you have to try a lot of things on the night. You know, he's got punching power, he's got speed, he's got everything, you know, and I knew he was a complete fire, you know, and um, I don't know, to be honest, I would, I would try a lot of different type of things, not just one thing. I'll try a lot of things and see if they work, but. You know, you just uh, you just gotta go. You only find out on the night. As soon as you step mm-hmm. in the ring, that's when you usually find out. You know, and uh, once you give it that shot, because you kind of keep coming forward if you're getting him with all those shots. You know what I mean? So, and you kind of really box if he's, he's if he keeps so he's too strong for you because he's just gonna walk all over you. So, mm-hmm. you really find on the night. You know, you have a game plan, but it might not go to plan. So, you gotta just uh, you gotta just on the night to find out. So, you know, it's one of the ones that I would you would try a lot of things. That's all I can say. Boxing, fighting, or well, moving your head, or even anything. But what mm. we do, you gotta, you can't, try, you gotta try coming out of the fight unscathed. You know what I mean? No getting hurt. Mm. That's the main mm. thing. Because yeah. uh, and not stay in the fight for too long, getting punished. Because uh, you gotta live to fight another day. You know what I mean?